In this video, I'm going to show you how to break down a pineapple and we're starting right now. So first, I want to thank my recent subscribers. You guys are absolutely amazing. We've managed to hit almost 5,000 subscribers with only eight videos. And I do apologize for the sporadic uploads. I do want to release more content a lot more frequently, but life just gets in the way. But hopefully we can grow this channel together to the point where I make it a full time thing. But moving along today, we're going to be breaking down a pineapple. And at first, these spiky little tropical fruits can seem quite intimidating. But in this video, I'm not only going to show you how to break down a pineapple in a simple and fun way, but I'm also going to show show you how to make it look beautiful as well. So without further ado, let's begin. All right, so here is our beautiful pineapple. And the first thing we want to do is pull one of the leaves out to test the ripeness. And if it pulls out easily, then you have a ripe pineapple. Now next, I'm going to cut the top and bottom off. And in the industry, this is called topping and tailing. So after we've topped and tailed our pineapple, we're now going to remove the skin. And here I'm demonstrating the motion we're gonna use when making our cuts. And keep in mind when removing the skin that we wanna maintain its shape and we wanna reduce as much waste as possible. And the reason for this is because we want to actually reveal those eyes and not cut behind them, removing too much flesh from the pineapple. So with this specific method, it might take a bit longer, but at the same time, you're wasting a lot less and it's going to be necessary when creating that look that we're going for. Now next, we're going to slice off any remaining dark green rind. Now that we have our whole pineapple with the eyes revealed, we're now going to slice it in half. So the reason why we slice it in half is because we want the pineapple to be stable and we don't want it rolling around while we try to remove the eyes. Now next, take your favorite paring knife. To remove the eyes, we're going to follow their natural path and this is going to be on a diagonal. So one way to do it is to make your first diagonal slice and then turn your pineapple around and make your second. And there we have a segment of eyes sliced out of our pineapple. And I'll do that with the entire pineapple until all the eyes are removed. And quick tip, make sure to keep your index finger on the spine of the knife whenever you're doing precision work. And that is one cool looking pineapple. Now next, I'll do that with the second half.
And there is our full pineapple with all the eyes removed and looking really unique. So next I'm going to show you how to remove the core of the pineapple. So we're going to slice our halves into quarters. And then once our pineapple is in these quarters here, we can angle our knife and remove that core. And the core can be quite woody, so you don't want to eat it raw. So next I'm going to slice these quarters in half. And you could put a skewer into this and put them on the barbecue for some really beautiful looking grilled pineapple. Now give it a little taste. And this one is perfectly ripe and juicy. So there you have it, the pineapple conquered and looking absolutely stunning. And pineapples are super healthy, so don't forget to pick one up next time you're at the grocery store. And leave a comment down below telling me which fruit you want to see me break down the most. And I'll make sure to put that in my list of videos. And to those who aren't subscribed and are watching, make sure to hit that subscribe button and hit that notification bell so you'll know when a new video comes out. And to all my home cooks, professional chefs and foodies out there watching. Until we meet again, keep on cooking.